Hello Vikings and welcome back to another awesome Great Valhalla video. In this episode we are gonna check a new location for the Avenge quest for avenging other players death. Also in the end of the video I will show a new location for the meteorites or burning statues or even the rainbows. This location was found by Woodland Outlaw who did leave a comment in my video a couple of times so thank you mate. And if you need to pause the video to read the whole comment, please do so. So, you need to come in Kent, so the southeast part of the map, the corner, you will find Odover Fortress, and in this location, you should be able to find Avenge Quest using the same method that we are using in the Scottish Farm in East Anglia. I will leave a video link in the pinned comment and in the end screen of this video if you want to check the original place for that one but let's go and let's do the Avenge quest after that the meteorites one negative thing in this location it is the fact this place is huge so if you find the body the people you need to kill they might be in the opposite direction that happened to me so first guy it is right next to party and the two guys they are in the opposite side of the fortress so let's kill this guy and let's skip to that location and after that boom Avenge quest completed so if you are having a hard time finding one in the East Anglia try this location also what you might want to try if nothing is happening in the first 5 to 15 minutes reset your game just like I'm gonna do by dying or loading from the save I think the best method is still dying also, if you are in the hostile area, resetting your skill points to 1, dying, they should be going back where they were without doing anything. So, yeah, you are dying much faster if you are level 1 and you are getting all of the skill points back on their places if you are dying in the hostile area. As promised, now we are gonna farm the meteorite. Yes, the same location, same spot. So, get away from the fortress and in the crossroads you will see boom. With the spark and the boom, boom, boom. So, we are getting closer of the crossroads. Also, we will hear a boom. Unfortunately, I did miss the first one. But there it is, the smoking rock aka the meteorite site. So let's head there, let's loot the thing. After that we are gonna reset this thing and farm it. You are getting iron, titanium and depending where you are, you are getting carbon, nickel or tungsten. The amounts are varying, doesn't matter which location you are, you might get one titanium to three titanium, you might get under or over 100 iron. What I did do, I spotted this big tree, went there and after the tree made a U-turn and boom, here we go. Another meteorite and we are gonna repeat this a few more times. So hopefully this will help you to get more materials to upgrade your gear. And let me know in the comments if you are getting meteorites or rainbows or burning statues in this location. And note, they are coming as random, so nothing can be guaranteed that you are getting meteorite, rainbow or burning statue, they are random. Also, I will leave my original video about the rainbow silver farming tactic in the pinned comment and in the end screen. So check that one out if you want. One more thing, if you like to take photos, yeah, blinding rush and you can get really close or even get hit by the meteorite. And those pictures can be awesome, as we can see here. But for now, Wolfpack, I want to thank my channel members, aka the Elite Wolfpack. If you want to become part of the Elites, you know what to do. But for now, let's roll the outro. Thanks for watching, remember to hit the like, hit the sub, turn on the notifications so you won't ever miss anything that I upload or when I go live. Also Vikings, 
have fun, stay safe, be strong. Hope to see you in the next one. Skatha, over and up, and bye bye.